Even if you don't wear makeup, even if you're like the most natural person out there who goes makeupless, what do you call those people? Minimalist? It would be really nice if you could comment down below and help me to remember that name. But let's go with minimalist. So even if you're a minimalist, every female puts lip gloss on or lip balm or petroleum jelly or some oil or some cocoa butter or some shea butter. Everyone puts things on their lips. So before I get into the video, just let me tell you real quick why I decided to buy this brand. Now, I saw someone with this one, as you can see. This must be my favorite because it's it's like done. It's almost done. And I love glitter, for all those who don't know. <laughs> I said, I'm like, what's that lip gloss you're wearing? She's like, oh, I don't remember the name and whatever else. So she's like, I bought it from Sephora. It was like a bunch of them. I'll give you the name so a few weeks after I saw her and I was like what was the name of those lip gloss that you were supposed to tell me the name of and she was like buxom and I was like okay and she's like you need to write it I was like no buxom so we're gonna do five days of buxom and I'll go with my favorite test one to my least favorite test one and my favorite favorite well it's a tie between this and another one but let's go with this because this one is almost done so I wear this most of the time and it has glitter the name of this is Dominique oh it's so cute ah oh, it's just so the name Dominique I have a friend by the name of Dominique and she's so girly yeah just like this lip gloss okay so it's just basically clear lip gloss and glitter basically As you can see, it's glistening in the sun. Now, I usually would put it on my bottom lip and then do like that. But for the sake of this video, I'll go all out more in there. I don't know why companies try to like cheat you. Just give me the product. Look, all the thing, the thing just need to touch the bottom of the thing like... Oh, I guess if you screw it all the way down, it touches more of the bottom, but it's a lot of work. Ah, this is so beautiful. I mean, look, this lip gloss is perfect for when you're wearing like minimal makeup. Like, I'm wearing minimal makeup, kind of, in a way. And you just want to have that bow. the glass is popping this is nice i i love this i've never actually put it on like this i always like do like a minimal kind of thing uh ooh, so this is day one stay tuned for day two so we're on to day two and for day two i will go with sugar huh. so yesterday it was Dominique and today it's sugar and this as you can see has it's obvious and evident that I love glitter it has glitter yes and it's kind of like peach mm. It's kind of like this earth looking peach thing like my camera can't autofocus but let's get right into it and in case you're wondering if it cracks or crease disclaimer these lip glosses well at least the ones that I've worn over time the colors that I've worn over time they do not leave that there is this like like when you wear lip gloss and it leaves this like white line right there like you're hungry or like it's spit build up or something saliva it looks disgusting and then there's up here it doesn't do that at all and for creasing the Dominique that's a clear one with the glitter it does not crease 
any at all um, I will tell you that this one does and I'll show you exactly I need my mirror I'll show you exactly what I mean so I'm heading out and I'll show you I'll wait until it creases and I'll show you how it creases and how it looks but I really love this one like honestly if this one didn't crease I would have said that this is my favorite but because Dominic doesn't crease Dominic is my favorite oh my gosh it's so beautiful I'm not going to put on as much as I did with Dominic with sugar I'm not going to put on a lot of sugar because of the creasing but I'll put it on on the out part out high right there I also forgot to mention that these lip glosses I don't know if it's peppermint I don't know what they put in there I'll have to look up the ingredients but it has this it says it makes your lips pout it's for pouting your lips I'm guessing that these lip glosses are not for people with thick lips or full lips like mine because it's like for pouting like to make your lips lips look pouty so I forgot to put that in there when I was trying on Dominique and you feel this tingly minty thing like it's like your lips have just been brushed with toothpaste it's, it's just it feels really nice like all right so I'm at the beach as you can see and uh, I don't know if that is sand or what it has a lip gloss but it's now like um, 622 so it was like two and a half hours ago I put this on and this is what it looks like so you see what I'm talking about the cracks so it's like the lip I didn't lick my lips or anything so it's like lip gloss just evaporated basically and then the cracks come so when you smile hey see I don't know if sun or whatever is on my lips I can't really see but you get the idea okay so now we're going to try mudslide <laughs> the sun is going down it's now minutes to six and I'm just gonna try this it actually looks like clay like a rose but earth rose color and this one is definitely cracking more than um, sugar so I won't put on as much as I did with sugar I noticed that you can put on more on your bottom when you have full lips like mine you can put more on the bottom than the top and it won't crack as much by the way also if like if you have pink lips like mine the bottom of my lips are like pink naturally and you've ever had like an issue with lip products changing the color of your lip like making it significantly darker this doesn't do that I've had that problem before I've worn lip product that makes my lip look like like literally like dark like I'm smoking weed or something hmm so this is mudslide I love this this is like a color this and well this is like a color that like those fly girls would wear like those hot girls would wear it's really sexy it's like a real sexy color and it's it's really cracking like let me come real close like it's it's and especially because it's showing on my top lip because my top lip is dark darker than my bottom lip so it's not really showing on my bottom lip that much because but look it's doing that slimy thing it's not my spit it's like look at that it looks gross <laughs> let me oh this is gross let me wipe some off from in on the inside because it looks as though 
spit is coming from my it's not spit so i don't even have to like do that after basically it's going to look cracked it's it's going to look cracked like these colors are for someone with lips identical to the color or if you have like really extremely light color lips like um like if you have pink lips probably to me this suits someone who is like lighter in complexion than someone who is as dark as i am because who wants to wear lip product that looks cracky as soon as you put it on today we have rose dulip julep julep and this is like um this is like barbie uh i will say though like to avoid cracking you can just put on like a light amount like so like really subtle like like lip balm and it won't crack for all the ones that crack you can wear them like this but just in case you want to turn up your lip gloss you can do like this So I should have made um, Rose Dulip my favorite over mudslide because it cracks way less. Like, blah. but it just it does that that and it does that like slimy spit thing. That's not spit less, way less. So I should definitely make Rose Dulip favorite over mudslide sorry mudslide so it would be maybe i should do a before and after of this one to show you what it would look like like in the next few hours so i went out and now i'm back and honestly it didn't budge like this is what i love about buxom lip gloss it the, the this is what i love about the buxom lip glosses it just doesn't budge like it stays put even when you eat food <clears throat> the most that will happen is food because it's very very sticky food will stick to the lip gloss and then sometimes you'd find me like if i'm eating crackers or chips or something like you would see like greens and stuff on my lips and they're like like literally pick it out but for the most part it's pretty durable apart from the cracks but this one doesn't look cracky like i i, I really should wear this one more often okay so this is the last one and today we have the vava plump honey this is my least favorite and i'll show you why it is very soon and then i'm going to use it with this um plump line lip liner um crayon and i look at my lips i don't need plumper lips than like my lips are like thick already but for the sake of the video i'll do it i chose a day where i'm not really going there and just along from family and friends like this is definitely for somebody that has no lips but i'll still do it honestly this is for some <laughs> No, this is just wrong. This is like too much. <laughs> I <ain't> even wrong. <laughs> this is why. This is my least favorite. Like, look at this. Like, this is just too bright. Like, like this is just too bright. Like, look at this. I there's <laughs> no way. <laughs> this is the evil I know.